Digital is of growing importance for us, right? We, have, we follow the economy, realizing that areas of work that we have covered for a long time in contracts, in industrial economics, are more or less following technology. It's the important question in these areas, or in finance, which is a big area for us too, is technology. So we are becoming more and more a digitally oriented research institution as well. We're going to uh, start with a presentation from Toulouse's uh, Nobel laureate, Professor Jean Tirol. Digital is a priority for TSC because uh, all industries are impacted nowadays and uh, uh, there are new business models and it uh, touches on many also issues of uh, you know, taxes and uh, organizations of firms and platforms. We have had a lot of talk today about platforms. Uh, this is all very important uh, for the future of our economies and we have to think more about it and of course TSC is well placed for that because we have been working on some of those issues for a long time but uh, new issues surface all the time so we, we have to keep on be, uh, being at the frontier. My kind of area of teaching and research is really trying to look inside organizations. So I'm not going to talk that much about platforms and Uber but kind of thinking a little bit more how digitization, uh, big data, IT is changing the way organizations are set up and how they make decisions. For me uh, what is interesting with this kind of uh, academic conferences is really to do justice to the subtlety of this revolution, uh, which is much more subtle than in the sense what we read in the media about uh, salaried employment is disappearing or uh, uh, like this sort of extreme views. In fact, it's much more subtle. Europe has had so much trouble managing to encourage and to obtain uh, technology adoption. Why, why, has it, why is it the case that IT hasn't really taken off as much? And uh, what are the reasons that productivity, uh, Augustin was talking about how productivity is really, uh, and, and adoption of IT is, is so slow, both in the US and in Europe. Um, and it has to do with a couple of things that I want to, to, to touch upon. I'll discuss uh, some of my work, some of my empirical work on, on these issues. Well, there's a great deal of interesting information on the economics of organization, whether firms should centralize or decentralize, or also whether or not these do business, new business models create value inside organizations or outside organizations. There's also clearly a great deal of social angst as we consider what's happening uh, in the new sharing economy. Are workers going to be employees? Or are they going to be freelancers? So there's a great deal of questions that we should use to inform policy uh, on those issues as well. I think it was actually quite nice to hear about each other's research at a high level and sort of get, you know, get some conversation going even amongst ourselves. Very, very interesting. Uh, I mean, it was, you know, diverse in terms of topics, but at the same time very insightful. Uh, and actually, I thought there was an interesting common thread across all of them, which at the end of the day is giving flexibility to firms and uh, letting firms explore different interests. So, very interesting.